we'll turn our attention back down to the Dumas Co-op for open shoot. Say thank you to Delana Hayes and the crew. It's time for our team roping competition brought to us tonight by High Plains Ag Services. Say thank you to Kent Simnocker and the crew. All right, we'll take a look at the leaderboard. In our team roping, 5.8, that was Vic Morrison and Hayden Cape last night, then a 6.9 and an 8.5. That's what we're running at. All right, team roping, you know how we play the game. The header starts behind the barrier. It's got three legal head catches available. Slick around the horns, one horn in the nose, or around the neck. When he changes direction to that steer, his healer will rope two feet. Now break the barrier, it's a 10 second penalty. Rope just one back leg, it's a five second penalty. Let's start with Kelton Hill and Derek Jansen. Canadian Texas on the head side. Ames, Oklahoma on the heel side. All right. Oh no, head lift's not gonna fit and that will be a no time for that team. Come on, say it with me, oh. All right, let's go to the Price boys, Ethan Price and Ian Price. Ethan on the head side. Ian on the heel side, Lady Oklahoma Cowboys getting set. How's the VIP tent doing over there? You good? All right. All right, Ethan and Ian getting set. 5.8, what we're running at, that was quick. So team roping, if you've got a steer that you need to doctor or take care of out in the pasture, well, this is how you get it done. Got it on the horns, now come around the corner looking for two on the back side. And heel loop is not going to fit, and that will be another no time. Make them feel a little better, folks. Well, let's go to Wyatt Murray now and Whit Crozier from Miola, Utah. All right, Wyatt on the head side, Whit on the healing side. Now, Sasha and Lester, this is something that you could do at home. Just get a couple ropes to one of your employees, maybe in the warehouse, chase them around. It'd be a lot of fun. And I want to remind you folks, Cowboy Classic Rodeo t-shirt on sale, just $20. We'll throw some of those out. Let's watch the run around the corner now, looking for two on the backside. Oh, no. And another heel loop doesn't fit, and another no time. Well, we need to change our luck right here. Let's do it with Kellen Allison from Wainoka, Oklahoma. Cole Coppets from Alva, Oklahoma, our next team to go. Hey, folks, look in your souvenir program. Somewhere in there, there's a little stamp for Aladino boots. We're going to give away $300 towards a beautiful pair of custom Aladino boots. And I was in their store this afternoon, and they do have some fantastic footwear as well as Western wear. Cinch. Area. They've got hats, they've got jeans, they've got boots, they've got everything you need to look like you are headed to the rodeo. Look in there if you have that that says you are a winner of that Aladino Boots credit, bring that over to the concession stand and we'll get you hooked up. All right, here's the run. Got it on and no, head loop doesn't fit and I tell you what. Well, Sasha's never been to a rodeo before. I told her all about the team rope, and we can't seem to get one call. This is embarrassing. Let's go to Levi Walter. Ray, Colorado, Riley Wakefield, O'Neill, Nebraska, be the next team. All right, I'm, I got a good feeling about this team. We're going to get something caught here. I want to say thank you to... Uh, all of our committee, Kit Dawson, William Darcy, Kent Simnocker, Tim Sally, Shannon Freeze, Justin Sullivan, Brian Freeze over there in the
concession stand. Great crew. All right, here's the run. Oh, no, the head loop comes off. And if it wasn't for bad luck, we would have absolutely no luck at all. Another no time. Five in a row. Folks, I think we need to change change the vibe in here, change the mojo. Cody Lewis, Pampa, Texas, and Jared Darty from Miami, Texas are next to go. When they nod, I want you to make some noise. Let's get some enthusiasm. Let's get some of your energy. Let's get a qualified run here in the team rope. And what do you say? You with me? Yeah. All right, here we go. All right, Cody on the head side. Jared on the heel side. Here we go. Here's the run. No, 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 no. Head loop doesn't work, and another no tap. Okay, okay, that one's on y'all over there. You didn't make nearly enough noise. So we're gonna try it again with Curry Kirshner from Ames, Oklahoma, and Jaden Lamont from Paulette, Texas. We just got two teams left to get something done here. Well, let's hope this is it and our open team roping brought to us tonight by High Plains Ag Services, Kent Simnocker and the crew. Thank you to them. High Plains Ag Services. All right, rope the head, rope the heels, looks easy. Yeah, got it on him. Now catch up, let's get to, yeah, yeah! Woo! Well, we'll take one leg, but that's better than we've been doing. Five, six, plus five in the field. 10 and six for that team, 10, six. All right, one team left to go here in our open team roping. This is Jesse Stipes and Casey Stipes, Salisaw, Oklahoma. Still running at that five, eight. Well, that last one would have been a 5-6 if we didn't rope just one leg, so let's watch the team. Oh, yeah, yeah! Woo! How about 6 and 5, 6-5 six, five for that team. Slides them in the number two spot. Nice run for the Stats boys. And that'll bring the curtain down on our team roping. Once again, we say thank you to High Plains Ag Services for bringing it to us. We're gonna stay down there with our 40-40 team roping. We got a little more team roping to do. And there's a, uh, yeah. Hey. M Mason, you all right? M uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh no. One of our bullfighters is down in the middle of the arena. We need, we might need the EMTs or a doctor or. We got a man down. Man down, man down. Hold it, hold it. What? Man down, man we down. We got a, we got a man. Ron. What? What are you doing? We need like the EMTs at the ambulance. Dude. What? Not you. Dude. You know what? What? He just passed out. I know, I told you he passed out. We need some emergency medical assistance. Emergency? Yeah, quit fooling around. Well, you know what? What? You in trouble, boy. No, that's not the kind of sister. What, you got that white coat on. Are you some kind of a uh, doctor or something? I got him. What? I got to move him over here. No, oh, okay. I got to examine him. You got to examine him. Well, hurry up. You know, the first thing I found out is wrong with him? What? He ugly. <laughs> well, you don't pass out from being ugly. If that was the case, you'd never wake up. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Let me get my, my, my tools. Yeah, hurry up. Tools up the train. Hurry. What, what? This is emergency. Everything's gone. They mean everything. What? I can't get it. Here, there it is. I got to get my, my stethoscope. What is that? That's what I listen to his heart with. That's a funnel. Poor people got poor ways. All right, well, hurry up. See if his, right. see if his heart's working. You ought to hear it. Okay, that's good. Dude, 
What? Two. He's still breathing. Okay, good. He breathing. All right. Barely. I tell you what. I think he needs a little air, though. He needs what? He needs some air. Some air? He needs some air. We can't use an air pump on him. Why can't it? I don't know. Works on my tire. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting some air. Hold on, please. I'm going to save your life. Yeah, that ain't working. That ain't working either. No. Okay. He don't need air. Hold on. What? I got something to get him. What is it? I hit him with my all clears. Your what? My, my feet are running off the leaves. Of what is that? One of them things hooked onto him and they jumped. Oh, okay. Yeah, try that. Clear. Hey. Didn't work. He moved. He moved, but he still passed out. Well, let me try him again. Hurry. There. Oh! <laughs> I think he's coming around. Yeah. I'll tell you what. I think you probably just cracked your trailer hitch. <laughs> I'll tell you what. It ain't broke, but I think you got a crack in it. <laughs> I'll tell you what. What? I know one thing to get him. What is it? I need one. Hey. What, are you, what are you gonna do? Dude. Yeah. Yeah. Hurry up. Come here. Come here. Hurry, man. The dude's gonna die if you don't hurry. I need your help. I need your help. What are you gonna yeah. do? You straighten that leg out right there. Yeah, straighten that leg out right there. We're gonna pull his arms. We're gonna put him right there. And get this arm here. Now, let's, let's roll in that way. Okay. Now. Now what are you gonna do? I need my glove. Why? I didn't tell you what kind of doctor I was, did you? What kind of doctor are you? I'm a proctologist. What? <laughs> oh, I got him up. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Ron Holder, the Ice Man from Holdenville, Oklahoma. <laughs> oh, good job. Put a finger in. Yeah. All right, well, let's turn our attention back down to the Dumas Co-op for Rope and Sheep. Our 40-40 team rope tonight brought to us by Feria Brothers Dairy. And we say thank you to Jason Feria and Amanda Law. All right, just like the regular team roping, except we call it the 40-40 because each member of the team has to be 40 years old or older or a female. Cashley Schweer, Scott Vanderham. This is the female option. Cashley on the head side, former Panhandle State University cowgirl, Scott Vanderham, Ingalls, Kansas on the heel side. Come on, Cashley. Catch it up, get it on him now. Around the corner, let's get two right here. Yeah, yeah. Woo! Nice run. How about eight and eight, eight, eight? That will go to number two in the round. Fast time of the rodeo so far was an eight flat, Randy and Scott Moreland. So eight, eight slides into the number two spot as we get ready for Brandy Hollenbeck. Moreland, Oklahoma, and Scott Riley from Alva, Oklahoma. All right, Brandy on the head side. Scott on the heel side. Yeah, yeah. Nice run. How about a 7-7 seven, seven goes to the lead. 7-7. Seven, seven. Nice. All right, Jason Dirks, Douglas, Kansas. T.C. Dawson, Haviland, Kansas, next to go. All right, Jason on the head side, T.C. on the heel side. So now 7-7, seven, seven, 8 flat, 8-8, eight, 8-9. Eight, 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 That's what the leaderboard looks like here in our Ferrier Brothers Dairy 40-40 team open. Off and gone. Yeah. Get on the head side now. Let's get some feet. Yes, yeah. Wow, when I were open, seven and eight, seven, eight. Goes to the number two spot. All right, let's go to Rusty Tooley and Mike Weir now, Dodge City, Kansas team. I was born on the Yano. Yeah, got it on him. Two feet, you bet. 
Well, I told you seven, 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 eight. How about a 5.8, 5 and 8? That goes to the lead. Nice run for the guys from Dodge City, 5.8. And that'll wrap it up for our 40-40 team roping. Once again, we say thank you to Ferrier Brothers Dairy, Jason Ferrier and Amanda Long for bringing it to us.